If you do go on to enjoy today's video, please consider liking it because I'm terrible at FIFA and I need all the self-esteem I can get. If you're interested in football shirts, football boots or anything football related, go check out my Depop. The link for that is also down below. And if you do need any coins, head over to u7bystore.com. Use the code TVM at checkout for a discount. The link is in the description. What is going on guys, Tim here, welcome back to a brand new video, uh, a quick-ish review really of the newly upgraded Triore. Um, I, I recently bought him for my team, I needed a new outlook really, I used one of my centre-backs, needed to change it a little bit, went with Triore, at right, he's going to be playing right back in a 4 triple 2 something that uh, I've only recently started doing, he used to play 3 at the back, so Triore would have played on the right-hand side of midfield, but I've switched it and he's now playing as a fullback. He does have a high attacking work rate and a medium defensive, which is not ideal. Only three star, three star as well. But because he's playing as a fullback, and I've actually got him on stay back or attacking, but I've also got him on overlap as well. So if I do send him on a run, he will go around the outside. He's quite useful as well, actually, because he's got that pace. And that is probably one of the biggest assets of this card. Uh, speaking of the upgrade, so he went from an 84 to an 86. There is a chance, if EA don't forget, and if the, the ruling goes the correct way, that he will go to an 87 as well. I'm pretty sure the game between Rene and Spurs, is it Spurs? Pretty sure it's Spurs, has been uh, postponed indefinitely, and I don't think they're going to have time to replay it. It's all like a, a COVID thing, so because it's a Spurs issue, I'm pretty sure, don't quote me on this, but I'm pretty sure Rene will go through, therefore this card is eligible for another upgrade. I think that's the way it works. I I don't really know for definite, so don't really take it as gospel, but I'm pretty sure this will go to an 87 at some point. But he's only about twenty to 25,000 coins, depending on your platform. He's a really good card for the coins, especially if you consider that he will go to an 87. If he doesn't go to an 87, he stays where he is. It's not the end of the world, but his starting position here is in the, inside uh, the opposing penalty area, gets back, steals the ball, and then all of a sudden, we're on another attack again. Beats his man on that outside because of his pace, plays a good ball into Lionel Messi, and he can't quite take advantage of it. But the thing I love about this guy is 98 stamina with that pace means that he can bomb up and down that right-hand side as often as I want him to. And then he comes across, he puts in a challenge, he's not the, he's not the tallest of players, he's 5'9 with 79 heading, and yet he's able to come across and win that header. The one thing that I wish the card had, which he will get over time, but I, I think Rene would need to win the competition. Well, then again, this is a road to the knockouts, isn't it? So he's not going to get that extra boost. I think he's only got the potential to go one higher and depends on the ruling in that um, of that fixture if it hasn't already happened. But um, the strength for me is a little bit on the low side for this type of card. I wish it was in the 80s. He would honestly be one of my favourite defenders in the game if it were in the 80s, but it is what it is. I am a really big fan of it though. For 23k on PlayStation, 24 and a half, 25 25-ish on Xbox, there aren't that many fullbacks in the game that are exciting to use, but Triore going forward, not the best at like shooting or anything like that, but obviously we're not really looking to score goals with him. Creating wise down that right hand side, he does it really well. And the ability to overlap and then come back and not really lose that much stamina, there aren't that many defenders at the moment in the game that can really rival what Triore can offer for the price in particular. If in a perfect world I could tweak a few things, I'd give him a four-star weak foot. I'd also give him about 85 strength. And I maybe would give him a little bit more reactions or composure. But honestly, apart from that, and, and that is like me going in a perfect world. You know, this isn't a perfect world and this is the card we have. For the money, you honestly won't be able to find a card that is much better than this guy, if, if at all. Big, big fan of him. Not the easiest to link unless you are using the Verratti card and Kimbembe or something like that to sort of box him into the corner. But if you are, trust me, use him. He is fantastic. Big, big fan of this guy for 23k. Let me know what you think of the video. If you have enjoyed it, of course, you can help me out by hitting the like button. You can subscribe to the channel for more content. And until the next time, goodbye.